Hey everyone, this is DHTV and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up and use the Touch ID or fingerprint scanner on the iPhone 5S. Let's get started. So the Touch ID or fingerprint scanner with the iPhone 5S is a great alternative to security and unlocking your iPhone rather than using the passcode. So what we need to do first is set it up and the way we do this is first by opening up the settings application. We're then going to scroll down to general and then finally we're going to scroll down to where it says Touch ID and passcode. Now from this stage here, if you've already set up a passcode, you'll need to enter it. If you didn't, you'll be automatically taken to the Touch ID and Passcode section. Next, we're going to go ahead and tap on Touch ID. And this is the section where we're going to implement our fingerprints. Now you can add up to five different fingerprints. So if you have multiple people using your iPhone, they can enter in their fingerprints as well. And that way they can unlock the phone. So what we're going to do is tap on Add a Fingerprint here and it'll take us to the instruction page. So the first instruction is telling us to place our finger or thumb on the home button. So for this example, I'm gonna use my index finger and I'll just place it on the home button. Now what you'll feel is a little vibration and this is to let you know when to release your finger from the home button. You'll also see that these little red lines start to complete the fingerprint. So that's how you'll know for the future instructions here how to go through. So it's telling us to lift and rest our finger on the home button repeatedly. So we'll go ahead and do that. So once the vibration, you can lift off, back on, vibration, lift off. So I'm just going to do this a little bit quicker here. You don't need to keep your finger 100% accurate. It's going to need to find all the different fingerprints that you have on your finger. If you do get it too accurate where your finger is sitting in this exact same position the whole time, you will be prompted to sort of move it around a little bit. Now this section here, it's saying to adjust our grip. So we're going to keep going and it's going to try to capture the edges of our print. So now I'm going to kind of move it this way, a little bit to the top, a little bit to the side. So we'll do that. And when you, again, when you feel the vibrations, you want to lift off. Now it says complete, touch ID is ready, your print can be used for unlocking your phone. So we'll go ahead and test this, but before then, if you get prompted with anything else that you haven't seen in this video, just follow the on-screen instructions. It's not gonna guide you in the wrong direction. So we'll go ahead and tap continue here. We'll go back to our home screen here, and I'm just gonna lock the phone. And then I'm gonna try to unlock it here, so we'll go ahead and bring it to this page, and I'm just gonna tap on it. So it says passcode required after restarting, so we need to do that. And now I'll lock it once again. And again, we'll give it a try here with my fingerprint. So I'll just bring it to the home screen and use my fingerprint. And there you go. Now it did say try again. I think that's because I got the bottom of my fingerprint. But uh, the fingerprint scanner, as I've tested it so far, seems to be pretty accurate. So we'll try it again and see if it figures it out. It does. As you can see, it is a little bit slow, a little bit of a delay before it unlocks the phone. But it does work. And we'll try it with another finger. Let's see if it works with this finger. Nope, it says try again. We'll just try with this one and there you go, you'll be able to unlock it. Now, unfortunately, it doesn't seem like you can unlock it from this actual screen when the phone is off uh, or when the screen is actually locked. So you do have to either press the home button to bring it to this screen and then just hold it. But you can actually do it in one motion just by pressing, releasing, and holding your finger over top of it, and then it will unlock that now, way. Now, if you ever want to delete or add a new fingerprint, you need to go back into the Settings app, General, scroll down to Touch ID and Passcode, and then you'll need to enter in your passcode again. And then from here, we're going to tap on Touch ID. And now to delete any fingerprint you may have added, so you can see I've got Fingerprint 1, you tap Edit at the top, and a little minus will appear there. If we tap on that, it'll give us the option to delete it and if you tap on delete it'll go ahead and delete that fingerprint now if you want to add a fingerprint we'll just hit done here if you want to add a fingerprint just go ahead and tap add a fingerprint and all the instructions that we just went through will be there for you anyway guys i hope you found this video helpful and enjoyable if you did hit that like button it helps support my channel also feel free to subscribe i post videos monday wednesday and friday all about tech how-to videos tips and tricks and if you want to learn more about the iphone 5s 5c or if you're using an ios device that's running ios 7 i have all refreshed how-to and tutorial videos in the description down below there's a link there for you you can go ahead and check them all out and learn some cool things anyway guys thanks again for watching i will see you in the next one